Osteoarthritis is a very common phenomenon that affects the vast majority of people in the country over the age of 55. It's the wear and tear in your knees that develops with repetitive use. It's pain in your hips, knees, or any joint in your body. Arthritis is gonna cause pain, it's gonna cause stiffness, it's gonna cause decreased range of motion, difficulty walking, achiness in your joints, and uh, inability to do the activities that you want to do. Well, osteoarthritis could be anything from wear and tear to complete obliteration of, of the cartilage in the knees, hips, and other joints. Usually when you have a lack of cartilage, the smooth surfaces that you were born with disappears or wears away. You have more of a grinding sensation and you don't have that healthy cartilage. And that grinding causes inflammation. That inflammation causes pain. So there are all ranges of types of arthritis. And the early stages we treat with non-operative means. But eventually when it gets to be severe, then we have to rely on operative means. And so once you've bypassed the region of those that can be treated with arthroscopy or those that can be treated with injections, medications, bracing, physical therapy, those are the ones that we have to talk about operative treatment with arthroplasty, either partial joint replacement or total joint replacement. Makoplasty is a revolutionary way to do total joint replacements. It can be used in both total knees, partial knee replacements, as well as total hip replacements. And what it is, is a way to put the existing implants into a patient, but it utilizes a robotic-assisted device. A patient obtains a CT scan of their joint prior to surgery, where we get very detailed information about their joint. And that's really what makes the big difference. With this information, we can individualize the placement of the actual joint replacement and match it to a patient's specific anatomy which in turn will decrease the pain associated with surgery and increase the longevity of the prosthesis. It's still the surgeon who places the implant in the right position, but with the makoplasty, using a 3D template, you can position your implants as accurately as possible. The robot is able to take that preoperative plan and execute it in the operating room with precision that we haven't seen before in any type of traditional knee or hip replacement. So we now have the advantage of the makoplasty, robotic arm, and robotic assisted surgery to do total knee replacement. That we're the only group in the area that has that technique available. Uh, we are the only group in the area that has robotic assisted surgery available. And it gives us the additional accuracy, the additional precision of putting the knee replacement in in precisely the way that we want to. We can do the surgery virtually before the patient's even in the operating room. We virtually can put those implants in, size them, check the balance, check the alignment, and then when we're intraoperatively, we can check the alignment again and fine tune things and tweak them to make sure that it's just right before we leave the OR. And it additionally gives us more precise information about balancing the flexion, the extension gaps that help with the patient's range of motion and their stability information that we didn't have available in the past. Typical recovery time for makoplasty, when it is at two weeks, you're walking with a, a walker or a cane, and, and at the four week mark, you probably get rid of the, the walker or the cane. A typical knee or hip has, has a variable lifespan. For a, for a knee, we expect something along the lines of 15 plus years. And this all depends on the patient, this all depends on, on the activity level, and for a, for a hip, we are getting numbers of greater than 20 years. With makoplasty, the, with the accuracy that makoplasty can impart to a surgery, we are expecting numbers that are higher than that. We are able to size the, the implant to the patient more specifically, and perhaps that would, would, would lead to a better outcome less pain and the knee or hip acting more like your native joint. Makoplasty is a way to do a joint replacement. So if a patient is a candidate for a joint replacement, they're a candidate for a makoplasty. We're lucky to have this facility in, in Syracuse. And we're lucky to have this machine in Syracuse so that we can actually perform makoplasty. The most gratifying thing is just the smile on their face when they come back and thank you 
and say that, they, that you've changed their life, that you've made things good for them, that their knee doesn't hurt, that they have good stability, that they can do the activities they weren't able to be, uh, that they weren't able to do before, or that their hip feels better and they can walk long. Quality of life is vastly improved following the surgery. Patients come in with pain, inability to ambulate, inability to complete their activities of daily living. And watching patients come in without any canes, without a walker, and pain-free brings absolute enjoyment to this profession. Get back in the game with Upstate Orthopedics. To learn more or to schedule an appointment, call 315-464-4472.